check it out later. It's parked right out front. Space 294. I'm sorry. 294? Yeah. That's my parking spot. <laughs> Why do you have a parking spot? You don't have a car. You don't even drive. But it doesn't matter. That's my spot. Maybe they reassigned it because you never use it. Well, I'm not using my nipples either. Maybe you should reassign those. <laughs> Sheldon, someday if you get a car, I'm sure they'll give you another parking space. I don't want another parking space. I want my parking space. It's perfect. It's a corner spot, cutting the risk of door dings in half. It's a mere 28 steps from the building entrance. The nearby tree provides shade on hot days and is also home to a delightful squirrel. Yeah, which is fortuitous, because most squirrels are real jerks. <laughs> Fun story. Meanwhile, you still don't have a car. Yeah, don't try to change the subject. This is about a parking space. It has nothing to do with cars. <laughs> are you listening to yourself? I always listen to myself. It's one of the great joys of my life. <laughs> now, get your car out of my spot. Nope. Very well. You leave me no choice. <laughs> What are you looking at, you stupid squirrel? Give it back. I'm sorry, but could you be more specific? My Iron Man helmet, Kutra Polly saw you take it, give it back. Oh, that. Well, see, I wanted it, and you weren't using it. You know, apparently those are the rules we live by now. Payback. It truly is the B word, isn't it? Sheldon, that is a $500 limited edition collectible, and I want it back. Well, I'd love to help you out, but unfortunately, I'm using it. <laughs> Fine. I'm taking your diploma. Go ahead. It's the only doctorate you'll ever get. Hi, Sheldon. Ah! He's in my spot. You'd let him make him stop being naked in my spot. Howard, what are you doing? He wasn't using it. And I needed a nice, cool piece of leather to wiggle my naked ass on. Get off there. Give me back my Iron Man helmet. Give me back my parking space. You don't need a parking space. You don't have a car. But if you don't need an Iron Man helmet, you're not Iron Man. Well, we appear to have reached an impasse. And you know, I have to say, I thought you'd be more upset that your laptop is sitting on my junk. <laughs> I didn't pick up on that. That's a nice touch. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? You said I'm not using my space, so I'm using it. <laughs> okay, you need to move now. No, I don't. You can't stay there forever. You, uh, actually, I have a plastic baggie strapped to my leg that says I can. <laughs> Give up, Wallowitz. You've chosen to tangle with a superior intellect you can't defeat. There is nothing you could possibly do to... <laughs> Those aren't going to help you, Sheldon. Oh, yes, they are. I mean, what? I'm warning you, Sheldon. Your threats are empty. Nothing can move me. Stop that. Get out of my spot. No, you, that's it. I am calling campus security. You prepare for the scolding of your life. Hey, sweet ride. Well, what are you doing in there? Just breaking in your new car. You stop that! Yeah, you know what they say. Revenge is a dish best served nude. 